Dear Wild Hunter friends, welcome back to the channel. Uh, in this tutorial, I'm gonna introduce you uh, a very interesting series of set uh, of uh, aftermarket sites by LPA sites in Sarezzo, Brescia, Italy, a, a European uh, leader manufacturer in uh, this kind of aftermarket accessories. Uh, this uh, line, this series, uh, is uh, the SP and uh, is, uh, to tell you the truth, is a series that uh, is uh, composed, is formed by three different sub-series, the SPS, the SPL and the SPF, depending upon the uh, type of uh, front sight that you are going to consider. The SPL, for example, uh, means uh, uh, Luminova uh, si sites. Uh, which is, what is uh, Luminova? Luminova is uh, a very uh, useful uh, type of uh, dots that are made by in, in painting. Uh, the color is uh, yellow, and the particular features of this kind of Luminova sites is that. Uh, there is no radioactivity, it is not tritium, is uh, highly visible in any light condition, I mean during the night or during the day, and this is a great advantage of uh, the, the, the tritium that is, uh, is very good for in night condition, in, in very dark condition, but uh, it's a nightmare during the day. Uh, so uh, it's, a, it's simply a, a painting that uh, is, is, it uh, acts uh, like uh, a battery. Uh, you can uh, um, put it under a torch, a torchlight, and for every minute that the, it stay, the Luminova stays in charge, uh, it, it, it has uh, 10, 12 minutes of shining in, at night. So if you recharge it with uh, whatever type of light torch you have, uh, for every minute you have 10-12 minutes of shining, so if you recharge for 40 minutes you can stay all night long with your Luminova sights highly visible uh, in, in, uh, in dark condition and even if uh, there is for example a night time in a town which is, uh, are, you have a lot of light you can see the, 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 your uh, dots uh, in perfectly. The, uh, okay. And uh, this kind of, of, uh, of uh, varnish, uh, this uh, kind of, of painting, is uh, very resistant to uh, the atmospheric uh, agents uh, and also is, uh, is very tough and uh, durable, reliable in, in, the, in, in, in time. So you, you have a lot of uh, um, good condition in which uh, to use them. Uh, the other series, uh, the, uh, for example, the SPF means uh, fiber optics. So in this series, you have uh, uh, the, the blade, you have two points of fiber optic, the green, two green points, and then you have the front side in red, with the f uh, red fiber optic. The other series, the SPS, is very simple. It has uh, the target blade with no reference, no fiber optics, nothing and you have uh, uh, the front sight in, in red uh, in fiber optics. Then there is another series, that uh, is, it means in the SPS series, that is the 30, and in that case you have all the three uh, points uh, in, uh, in, uh, sh in white, uh, but shining white, and I mean it's very visible, uh, both uh, two reference in the, in the blade and, uh, and also in the front sight. Okay, um, this series is uh, available in 12 models and each model uh, has uh, four types uh, of uh, front sight. Okay, so you can choose uh, for every model you, you decide, uh, depending upon the, the type of semi-automatic pistol you have, because this series is uh, completely dedicated and compact for compact uh, uh, semi-automatic pistols such as the Beretta APX, the, the CZ-01 Shadow and so on. I will give you a, a, a list, a complete list in a few seconds in which you can see all the models available. So, uh, this is uh, the main uh, features of, the, of this series. In, in what co it consists, this uh, kit, this set? The set consists in the front side, then you have the rear side, 
that is completely adjustable uh, via uh, two uh, micrometric screws. The, uh, all the, the rear side of this series are very compact, the low profile, it's very streamlined, all the angles has been shaped uh, because uh, you do not want to that your pistol uh, get entangled in the holster or in the, uh, on your uh, uh, switch. So they are very streamlined in order to avoid any tangle in any in any case. And uh, also, it's uh, it constructed, it, it is built on very tough steel, so very durable, very reliable. Okay. And also in the kit you can have also the screwdriver uh, for so if you want to adjust all the two uh, the two micro matrix uh, uh, screws you can do it uh, with this tool that is uh, in the in, inside the kit so it's very complex. Um, for uh, now I'm going to show you this slide in which you can see uh, all the models available. I, I'm going to show you some examples of this uh, kind of series, the SPL, the SPS and the SPL and then I will show you uh, after what we are going to do in this tutorial. Dear well done friends, welcome back. So for this tutorial I have decided to, uh, to show you one special kit is the SPL, so with the Luminova sites. Uh, and I have uh, decided to uh, change, uh, to change uh, the, the stock uh, sites of, of uh, a CZ SP01 Shadow. This is a, a semi-automatic pistol that is very has has had a, a very a great success because it is uh, the sport version of the CZ75, which is uh, mainly a military and a law enforcement uh, semi-automatic pistol. So this uh, this uh, kind of uh, target uh, pistol ha has had a, a great success commercially but it lacks a little bit uh, in uh, regulation of the, in the stocks on the stock side. So with this kind of kit, uh, your uh, shadow uh, will have a, a facilitate uh, uh, zeroing uh, operation. So you can, uh, you can adjust uh, the, all the sights uh, in a very accurate manner. So uh, your, your pistol uh, uh, will be more precise, more accurate and also uh, you can use a different type of ammunition simply adjusting uh, the, the two screws okay so you can pass uh, if you register uh, uh, in, in, in a notebook in a notebook uh, your uh, or all the how many clicks you have to, to, to apply on, on the windage and elevation you can use uh, two or three types of ammunition in the same session and this is a great advantage. Also uh, the acquiring of the target is faster, is more accurate, so uh, simply uh, using this kind of, of set of uh, sights uh, your uh, CZ shadow pistol will, uh, will be uh, far better than the, the original the stock one. Okay, and now what are we are going to do, we go uh, to the, our gunsmith, we will remove the original the stock uh, sites, we will replace them with this, this kit and then we will go down to the shooting range in order to verify how, my, how uh, much accurate uh, and, uh, and, uh, and easier is the zeroing operation with this kind of LPA sight SPL series. Now we are ready to go. Uh, the first operation is to remove uh, the stock front sight. Uh, 
uh, we must say that we have to remove first the pin. Uh, the pin has a diameter of 1.75 millimeter. Once we have removed the pin, we will remove the, the, the stock, the original front sight that is going forward, okay? Then we will replace it with the, the one of the Luminova set kit and then we will have to uh, make a hole on the, on the new uh, front sight uh, with a, a drill, drilling uh, with a 1.75 millimeter uh, uh, point. Okay, now uh, Loreno will start. Now that we have uh, uh, placed the, the new front side, let's go to the uh, rear side. The rear side is uh, fixed with a dovetail and a screw that is uh, put on pressure. Okay, so we have uh, to untight the original screw, then we remove the old tag, the old front uh, rear side. Then again, we will put the new one that has uh, two screws in order to make uh, uh, more pressure on the dovetail and to, so the, the, the rear sight in this case uh, or by LPA sight can stay tighter than the original one. Ora fissiamo le due viti. Now we tie the two screws with the Allen wrench that is in the kit. Lo facciamo con la chiavetta brugola che è fornita nel kit. Eccoci qua. Now we are ready. Ora rimontiamo l'arma. Now we assemble again our shadow and then we will go at the shooting range to zeroing our 921 in shadow pistol. Ecco, adesso siamo a posto. 
eh, vi faccio una, una leggera macro e poi andiamo ovviamente vedete come brilla bene questa luminova la potete vedere perfettamente bene adesso con Loreno andiamo giù al tunnel a sparare ok Qualche... now we are with Loreno at the shooting range uh, we are going to show you how we are going to zero in uh, the our CZ shadow with the new LPA sights You can see that uh, for what it concerns the elevation we are okay. We have uh, just to move uh, a little bit on the left, uh, the small group of two shots we have done, so uh, it, it, it will take just a little adjustment. Okay. even three clicks on the left You have seen uh, two shots are in the bush, on the blue side, another one went a little bit, a little bit on the left, but uh, we have given one click on the right in order to see if we are really okay. As you have seen, uh, all uh, the two shots, uh, the two last shots, uh, when inside the bullseye, we, we only need uh, to make another click on the right, and we are okay. Now some this dear well done, friends. As you have seen, uh, with few shots, uh, we are in the bullseye. Uh, we need to uh, give you two consideration. The first one is that the Luminova uh, dot sites. Uh, we have uh, found that they uh, are uh, a way better than the fiber optics. In any condition, uh, uh, in a tunnel, in the shooting range, uh, in, in dark side, in, in low light, in, in a, a lot of light, we are, you are able to see them in any condition, really. This is a great advantage uh, for, for any shooter. The second consideration is that uh, you have micrometric uh, adjustment both in windage and elevation and this allows you to use uh, many different types of ammunition just uh, uh, 
with few clicks you can you can adjust every group with every uh, type of ammunition and this is a great advantage because uh, you are able to use uh, this kind of semi-automatic pistol in any uh, condition I mean uh, law enforcement military just target uh, fun shooting everything and uh, as you can see uh, on the list uh, price of the of LPA size this is uh, a set that is very cheap it's very cheap and with few dollars you can have a great number of advantage over the stock size. Okay, thank you very much for the attention. I will see you again in the next tutorial with a new series, a new family of a set of sites by LPA Sites in Sarezzo, Brescia, Italy. Thank you very much.